So, we know that the Apple VR headset is around the corner, but what about the Apple Glasses project? Will we see the Apple Glasses launching in 2024, or will we have to wait a bit longer? Well, today I want to go over all the most recent details we know about the Apple Glass project, including features, and of course the Apple Glasses release date and price. Now, already in 2023, there are some companies out there making AR glasses like Nreal or Jame Smart Glasses that were shown back in February time. I plan to get my hands on some of these soon too. But we also know that Facebook with Meta, Sony with their VR2 headset and other companies are creating devices including Apple who are both making the VR and also AR headset devices. The VR device that Apple at the moment are making is reference to Apple VR but the other device is more to do with AR and at the moment it's likely to be called the Apple Glasses. Apple been pushing on a lot since the old iPhones came out in 2015 with AR capability and since then we've had enhancements like the LiDAR sensor being introduced and also the fact that machine learning is everywhere in Apple's chipset known as the neural engine and it's enhancing AR abilities. We've seen abilities with AR machine learning and iOS for example showing more abilities like AR street view on your iPhone as you walk around the city or even the new live text feature for example. Example. Then there is the new feature of visual lookup, even this machine learning and abilities we expect to see inside the new Apple glasses. The Apple VR headset project is the first major step for us to get the Apple glasses and Apple are counting on the success of this project first of all before releasing any of the new Apple glasses. So, looking at reports and leaks, Ming-Chi Kuo has even told us that the Apple VR headset is going to cost a fair bit in 2023, but he's also said that the second generation VR headset is not that far away and will be released in 2025 and it will be coming in at a far lower price. Why this is relevant, this could mean that Apple are not going to be planning on releasing any Apple glasses in 2023 or even 2024 and it looks like the earliest we could see some could be with those cheaper VR headsets that come out in 2025. As I mentioned before, Apple needs to work out if they're going to go full steam ahead on the Apple Glasses project and they're relying on people and turning their heads, excuse the pun, to the Apple VR. Bloomberg recently also said that Apple Glasses project has been suspended indefinitely, what basically means they're not going to be working on it anytime soon. However, I do not think this is the case, especially with companies like Jame and Enreal, and probably more companies over the next couple of years are going to be releasing their own AR glasses, and Apple want to get back into the game there and also bring out their own VR headset and become a great successful player in that in area and I definitely think the Apple glasses will definitely be coming back full steam ahead especially also we saw recently a partnership between Snapdragon, Samsung and also Android 2 looking to working on VR and AR capabilities. We've got to remember that, for example, that we heard that the iPhone SE project also got shelved some time ago, and then a matter of months later, it was being worked on again. It is something what Apple like to do. They like to say they've shelved something and then bring it back to life straight away. And I think this is going to be the same with the Apple glasses. So then guys, just quickly, this channel recently got over half a million subscribers, what is absolutely amazing. And you can check out the video on my channel to see who won those prizes but we're doing another giveaway now and this giveaway is going to be happening around a sort of mid-june time some point after wwdc and at this giveaway this time guys i'm going to be giving away three prizes the first two prizes are runner-up prizes and that are some airpods 2 and also i'm going to be giving away some airpods 3 as well what's absolutely amazing then the main prize that i'm going to be giving away to one lucky subscriber is one of these 
these. It is an iPhone 13 Pro Max in the silver white color. And I'm gonna be giving this away to one lucky subscriber. And all you need to do to enter in is basically put your opinion in the comment below of the report of this video, or tell me what Apple technology gear you're planning to buy or hopeful to get in 2023. As I already said, guys, the giveaway is happening in June time. So if you're brand new to this channel, make sure you subscribe to this channel and also hit that notification bell because you'll want to get that notification of when that giveaway is happening in June time. So make sure you do that right now. Now, something else I just want to quickly say, there are lots of imposters out there, a lot of them faking to be me, telling you that you've won yourself like an iPhone or another prize. And basically these people are telling you to part with some of your money to pay for shipping. This is not me at all. If you get a WhatsApp or Telegram or be told to send one of these messages, make sure you do not do it. This giveaway that I am doing is an international giveaway and I'll be paying for the postage, taxes and all of that. So if you do get a message to say that you've won an iPhone, for example, Example, and basically you need to pay for the shipping please do report it here on YouTube all you have to do is click on the comments and basically click report and YouTube will do the rest just make sure you do not part with any of your money to these scammers out there so to summarize again all you need to do is comment on as many videos that I create out there to enter in and also at the same time make sure you subscribe to the channel and also hit that notification bell to be in the chance to win one of these free prizes and with that guys it's back to the video so next of all let's get the big item out of the way on the agenda and that is the apple glasses price so a source suggests that the apple glasses will actually cost around 499 us dollars and of course that is not including any prescription charges to alter the glass lenses if needed however as we have seen in other leaks around and about that we've been told that the actual vr headset is actually going to be coming in at three thousand dollars to begin with it's hard to believe that the prices of the Apple glasses are going to be as low as $500. So it's probably more likely they're going to be coming in at over $1,000 at least for the first generation. And there again, for anyone who's also worried about prescriptions for your normal glasses, reports have already declared that prescription lenses and display technology will work fine with your new frames. So don't need to worry about that. Apple is all about health and accessibility, so this is something I'm sure they would not miss out on. So next of all, let's talk about the design. The Apple glasses are going to be designed in the best way to resemble sort of traditional glasses and not look like a VR headset. The frames will have the ability to shine information onto the lenses and that you can interact with this information with either gestures or with your iPhone. Apple is rumored to be planning to use Sony Micro OLED displays that features an ultra fast response rate, ultra high contrast, and a huge color display palette. The lenses will also work in dark and very light environments, so you don't need to worry about that either. We've also been told that the Apple glasses will also be dependent on your iPhone. Minchi Kuo has confirmed this and said that first of all that you will have to have your iPhone nearby because most of the computing and the machine sort of power is going to be happening inside the actual iPhone and at least this will be the case for the first few generations. If you do remember back to the original iPhones we did actually depend on iTunes quite a fair bit and it wasn't until around about the fifth generation iPhone that you could set up your iPhone completely independently and Apple completely cut the cord. So it seems likely that something like this is going to be happening with the Apple glasses too. There are also going to be lots more leaks and reports coming out for the Apple glasses in the future and probably over the next year or so, especially with the launch of the Apple VR and how that completely unfolds. At the end of the day, information right at the moment, it's not fully developed. It's still very, very early days. But let me know in the comments below what features you would love to see on the Apple glasses and maybe tell me how much you think they should cost and also when you think they'll probably also come available. I also plan to make more videos over the next few weeks and months about the Apple glasses as more information unfolds. In those videos, I will also share more details on features and basically how everything will work too.
So as I wrap up this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to keep on track with the progress of the Apple Glasses project. Also, if you want to hear more about other other upcoming Apple products too, make sure you sub to for that reason. And on that note guys, if you have enjoyed watching this video, please do press the like button and I will see you really soon. Take care.